Hello, my name is Christian from Pedrola, Trading with Know-how and Transparency. Today we want to discuss the performance of all the trades, what we did in the past and, and all the recommendations from YouTube. So if you don't want to miss any of the videos in the future, just make sure to subscribe here to our channel, leave a comment or a like. We would be happy if we can answer all your questions here in one of the next videos. But now we will go to the screen and check all the symbols and all the stocks from our previous videos and also the results. Beside TradingView and YouTube, we also have a free stock market community in WhatsApp. You can join this for free from our website. And we want to check today not only the TradingView setups and YouTube videos and the result of these trades. We want to see all the trades what we had especially here in our WhatsApp community. And for this, we will go to the screen. First of all, we will check the total result of the performance report. We can see here, for example, that these were all long trades, no single short trade here. And I think what's um, most important is the total number of trades was 13. We had 11 winning trades, two losing trades, here you can also see the average net profit as well as the average winning trade and losing trade. Most important for me is always to have an overview about percentage of profitable trades with 84%. It's quite good. What is not good, of course, is the ratio between average win and losing trade. We will later see which trades were positive and which trades we had here as um, losing trades. Here's some more numbers who want to check it out can also see here all the details for this 13 trades with the largest profit and loss and also the average efficiency. But I think for us it's interesting is the symbol list here and once again here the performance duration from end of December till end of February. So exactly two months. You can see here this 13 trades and um, yeah, last two mostly because of um, Boeing. We had a few, or we had one and two losing trades in a row. But now we want to see exactly the trades for this. I copied all the symbols here in our radar screen. We can see, for example, Melco Resources resort and entertainment what we had earlier also in a youtube video it didn't reach our target but as it came back below 13 we still closed it with a profit here and i think um, if i see what them um, in the market happened in the last uh, few days it's still a good investment can be still a good entry especially now after it also got back almost to the same price where we bought it and especially here you can also see what was the reason the high volume especially on the call option side, what we had here as well in February. So for MLCO, I'm still very positive, can be still a good investment for the next um, few weeks or months. But let's go to the next one. In total, we have a few more symbols to check. Shopify was also one stock from our WhatsApp community. Here, there was also a pretty high volume and then the breakout so we just took like 10 percent profit of course it went up much more after this almost to 45 dollars uh, what is in total i think 20 percent but as you can see it's a very volatile stock and since the last two weeks it fell even down below our entry but the good thing of the whatsapp community comparing to youtube and also trading view you will have it real time on the day when we see it, so exactly on the same day when we open the position, you can do here the same in your own portfolio. Then Tesla was another very interesting stock, even it's still going up. We closed it here at $200. Entry was also here pretty close after the earnings. And since then, Tesla was one of the really good movers. It was also included in our video for the best and worst stocks in 2023 and as you can see here we have the five or five top and five flops the video you can also check here on the right hand side in the corner 
Let's continue with the rest. Snapchat was also quite interesting stock. I think performance wise, the best of all investments. We almost reached here the maximum. It was 25% what we took here as performance. And as well, it was one of the stocks from our WhatsApp community. Let's check the rest. It was Kameco Corporation. Here we had just a small profit. It's also not so volatile, especially after it went already in direction of our stock market order. And then there was this jump above 29. We decided to close the position. Same happened here to Texas Instrument with the symbol TXN. It's break even after it went up a few percent, came back to our entry price. We just closed it with a very small um, profit. That's why also the average win and average um, loss ratio is so bad because break even trades or almost break even trades, they have a very small amount. So that's uh, why the profit or the average profit is much lower than the average loss. Same happened to our symbol PATH. We had it also as a trading view setup. It moved just too fast in the direction. So we didn't hit the target. That's why we also closed it almost break even after it came back. The same, or almost the same. No, this was BP. BP we was post earning trade went up quite well also as you can see we really had a good exit at forty dollars and sixty seven cents but it's still there and in total was also more than ten percent on this um, setup and yeah as i said as you receive this um, signals real time on the same day where we see it in our screening you can also decide your own stop your own target we just try to find good interesting stocks from our screening what we will share with the whole whatsapp community and that's why I think it can be very interesting to join this WhatsApp community for free. Let's check the last few symbols. One was um, Lyft. After the earning were so disappointing, there was a technical reversal, I would say, where we also took like 10% um, in profit. And Boeing, we discussed it in one of our last videos, was one of the stocks where, which went to the stop loss after it went below $200. We closed the position, same as Caesar Entertainment. This was the two losing trades and the last winning trades was the uh, earnings trades on NVIDIA. Also from Chunks risk ratio, not the best, but still a small profit what we were able to close last week. We still have also some positions open. First of all, American Airline, I think. Also, a stock what can be quite interesting. It's still around the price where we bought it. Also, on a short period, that's um, normally not something for buy and hold investors. C A N O, also a symbol, what was from our WhatsApp community. community Also, here with a big increase of call options. That why, that's why we opened the position. So far, there's not a big movement. Can be also possible that we need to close it in the next few days if nothing will happen. The two latest or three latest entries were Mons TEVA, Israeli truck or pharmaceutical um, company, what also just um, went a little bit in profit and now back. There's not a big movement at the moment. Same what we had for the ETF on the Euro stocks 50. With the jump today, it went back to profit. It's one of the first short entries uh, with a short position. And the last one at the moment is here, CTLP. So that's all the existing positions. And here we can see the results of what we try to trade from the signals in our WhatsApp community. Yeah. Like uh, we showed earlier here, I think it was quite interesting to see how, they, how the symbols moved after the recommendations, after our videos and also after our trading view setups. If you want to see in the future some other symbols, feel free to leave a comment. We are flexible and we will be happy to um, present any of the symbols what you leave here in the comments um, in the description. And yeah, just make sure to subscribe to our channel. We will be happy and hope to see you soon. Thank you very much.